as long as you can remember, legends have been told about the derelict mansion upon the hill that casts a blanket of darkness over the town. The history of the house itself is virtually unknown, and even the town's oldest residents cannot remember the mansion's origin. Being an avid history enthusiast, you embark up the mountain to visit the manor, hoping to shed some light on the backstory of this crumbling fortress of darkness. Hello everybody, I'm Zombie Sax, and welcome to my let's play of... Spooky's House of Jump Scares! Spooky, right? You can tell by the music. Yeah. So, that's it. Spooky's House of Jump Scares. What am I going through, a haunted house or something? This is so loud, must be exhilarating. Scores? Exit? Of course I want to exit, this is too scary. Not play before, so I shall start a new game. Controls, move, WASD, or arrow keys. To look, you use the mouse button. Button. Machine thing. To activate things, you use the use key. The universal E key. Sprint and shift, duh. Use weapon. Like a weapon. Left click. Okay. Say, sounds easy enough. Let's go! Oh, hi. What's Hello, happening? I am Spooky. Who are you? Oh, hi, Spooky! Oh, you're kinda cute! Cute. Is my home. Can you nice place you got here. A thousand rooms? Oh yeah, that's what I read on Game Joel. Duh. Is that, I don't really know. Anyway, just, just go. Okay. Can I go? No? Okay. Well, looks like I'm going through Spooky's House of Jump Scares. Spooky's not, all, not that bad. Hmm. What is this, some sort of cartoony SCP-087B going on here? What is this, a spooky teared paper portrait? Mmm, they look like eyes, I don't like eyes. What's in here? Oh god, can I go back? Oh no, 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 I wanted to go- Ah, mmm, whatever. So I have to go through a thousand rooms, apparently. Why am I going through a thousand rooms? Do please, spooky? Can I take a nap? No. What's in the drawers? I'm assuming I can't use anything, so I'm just going through. Uh, can okay. Remember that I can't do anything. Just walk. Can I at least take a torch? Absolutely not. That's ludicrous. What makes you think? Oh, nice purpley aura. Ooh, really sets a dark, deep ambiance. Okay. I swear I heard something. No. I did, I heard lack thereof. Just kind of went quiet when I went there. Ooh, more, more spooky purpley room. Ooh, that's devious. Mmm, mmm. This is quite spooky. I am legitimately terrified. Mm-hmm. Mmm, spooky frame rate loss. Nice carpet. So far, I am not experiencing any fright at all. Mmm, I have a choice. Do I go forward or right? Or do I sit on this table with a candle, crying about how my life is a, is a mess? I'll just go forward. Okay. So far, so good. By the way, if you hear a machine running outside, that's a lawnmower, in case you're wondering. Okay, this is so far the spookiest thing I've seen, and that's a house burning. That's not that spooky, but that is. Especially with that weird beady-eyed thing in the back. What are those nails or stalagmites? Or am I in a cave? Obviously not. You can tell by the bricks and cobblestone on the floor. So. Spooky. I do love that concept. Even when these paintings are here. Not even paintings. They're literally just paper. It's literally just paper framed up on the wall. And it's a bit teared up. How is that in any way spooky? Now that is spooky. Just like an empty room with nothing like a sepia tone. With that lone light bulb in that dark corridor right there. That's spooky. When you see when you see something like a blue bed with like, like a tray for a pillow. 
You don't find that all too scary. It's, it's, I guess it's, I guess it's the principles. Damn. Their architecture must be off if they want to have, like, marble pillows. I guess each to their own, in terms of comfort. Ooh, what is this, a secret door? I know a secret door when I see one! Do I need to spin around four times? Do I need to use my thing, my touch screen, laptop? No? Okay, moving on. Ooh, I am legitimately terrified. Oh, jeez, I... I'm already... Oh, wait, why do I have a health bar? I just realized... Has that health bar... <gasps> <gasps> <laughs> Fuck you. F you. Oh. At first, this place just seemed cute, but I've been here for days now. I'm feeling quite parched now, and I keep getting this feeling like I'm being watched by someone. This isn't romantic at all. What? Was spooky and, like... Did she lure you in here with her with her succulent voice? It's just a cardboard cutout of a skeleton. I just got scared by that. So scary. So spoopy. Three spoopy five me. Come on. Throw something big at me. Not really. When I said throw something big at me, I don't mean throw a big... Throw a big piece of paper at me on the wall. It's framed! What's so scary about it? It's broken? It's decrepit? It's just a torn up piece of paper. Uh, I don't like these corridors. Can I sprint? Oh, yeah. Oh, that's my stamina bar. Okay. Now that I can blaze through these corridors, I know that I can, uh, you know, go through this with relative ease. I'm not even at room 100 yet. This is gonna take a while. I might as well make separate parts for this. Ah, uh, shoot. I should have set up a timer. That got decrepit fast. Nya! Nya! No one there? Nya! No one there? Nya! I know something's there! Nya! Ooh. As I'm getting deeper and deeper into the depths of this castle, I realize that I am eternally screwed. Even when I- <coughs> <coughs> I was in the middle of a monologue! Shut up! <coughs> I don't like this place. They just pop up. It's not- It's not the fact that the skeleton is scary. It's just that it just comes up when I least expect it. If this is what this whole game's gonna be, I'm gonna have an easy time. Hmm. Why is this all fenced off? What is the point of this? Is there like some sort of evil being behind these things that I should not find? You know, now, just, you know, if you want to throw it at me anytime, you know, I'm, I'm... Aww. See, I wasn't even scared by that. It's kind of cute. Nice little cardboard cutout. Spooky's, Spooky's a nice person. You know... I doubt I'll be able to get to room 1000, like on the dot. I really hope I, yeah, I can save my progress. That's, oh, hello, Mr. Frame Rate Loss. Nice to see you. Hmm. Okay. Stop it. Change your bed. Your mattress is a bit too springy for what you're commencing. I do not like it. I have morals. Again, I cannot use anything. Get that through your thick skull. You cannot use anything here. I'm about to hit 50! Oh, oh. <laughs> Hang in there. I know something is following me, but I feel like I am prancing through the same rooms over and over. Trust me, that's how I feel too. Hopefully in leaving notes as breadcrumbs, I will prove I am making progress and reaching some destination. I just hope I don't run out of ink. I am dreadfully thirsty. Are you implying that you are drinking the ink in which you are writing with? Why are you writing with your own beverage? That's my question. Nice little, uh cross of hope right there, and a nice little kitty hanging on to a branch. Hang in there! 
I'm I'm more worried about him, not me. Oh. Yeah. Um. Oh, okay, I just activated the elevator. Oh, I guess I'll get to floor, I'll get to room 100, and then I'll, uh, I'll, uh, change, make a new episode. Now we descend into the dark depths of the castle. Spookies, ooh. Okay, the more, the farther I go down, the more dark and decrepit it'll get. Okay. So I'm just gonna get to floor 100. <laughs> You're not that bad. You're not as bad as the skeleton. Can I go by? Okay, thank you. They're just cardboard. I'm getting scared by cardboard. Let that sink through my mind that I'm getting scared by cardboard. Can I just go in here? At least I'll be safe from all the cardboard cutouts. <laughs> Holy shit, you're loud. Be quiet. Ink. Not quite quenching my thirst. Taste is terrible. Stains are terrible. Well, you're also writing with your beverage, and one of those coffee stains all over the paper, I don't think you're just drinking ink. I don't think drinking it was a very romantic idea. Hmm. Let us sip ink from our wine glasses. That is a phantasmal idea. Hmm. Quite. I am quite parched myself. Not quite parched to be drinking ink. I mean, it's not like this guy can go out. I mean, once he goes in, it's like the point of no return because he can't really walk back. Burning house, yada yada yada. Metaphor for everything there is in life, blah blah blah. Oh, hi. You're not dis- you are disturbing. What are you supposed to be? You are a hooded figure. Waving at me. Hello. Can you wave at me? Do I have a choice here, or will I just end up in the same room? I am a lefty, so left is always the right way to go. Somebody convulsed all over the floor. I do not want to go near that. Oh, what do you know? Note. Spouting, splashing, soaking, innards, ingest, invoking, nailing, never stops the choking. I'm sorry, is the cycle from Borderlands 2 here? Oh god, no, 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 what the fuck is going on, what the fuck is going on, what the fuck is going on? Oh, that's slowing I got spit all over my screen. I got spit all over my screen. I got spit, 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 spit. I don't even know what's going on. I don't even know what's going on. I don't even know what's going on. Stop it, stop it, stop it. You're scaring me. You're scaring me. This is supposed to be a nice, nice fun game. Nice fun game. Fun game. Fun game. Fun game. Fun game. It's fun. Very, very. God, stop! Stop running! You little bitch! Come on! Stop making noises! You're scaring me! Stop it! Stop it, please! You are spooking me! Um, what's going on? Uh, can somebody please inform me what's going on here? I don't like the sound of this. I don't like the sound. I don't like what's going on here. <sighs> Thank you! I can wipe the... Oh, hi, a new painting. I can wipe the spit off of my screen. Yeah, touch screen, please stop it. Yeah, what in hell was... What in God's name was going on there? Was I being... I know I was probably being chased, but... Thanks for the infographic! I didn't know I was in the Tetris world. If I were to fall, would I die? Okay, no, I can't even jump. That's kind of concerning. I'm only halfway to floor 100. Halfway as in I just took that elevator. Um, was that something I should be worried about? I feel like that's something I should be worried about. But I shouldn't worry about anything. Why? Who would design their mansion like this, honestly? What's even down there? Do you even have a purpose for this? Is just is this just like your body hole where you throw the bodies of the people who failed your little like freaking house of jump scares? Any paper here? No. Do I do I honestly want to go down there? I don't think I want to go down there. But, you know, going here wasn't a good idea either. Can I just sit here? 
Nothing can really get me except what's in front of me, and if something kill if something comes up in front of me, I'll just kinda jump off there. Cause it's probably a better place to be where, you know, than here. Honestly, why would you want to be here? Oh, stop it. Kindly stop it. Is there a note there? No. Can I please get the floor or room 100? Hmm. You know, the cardboard cutouts are the least of my worries now. At least I have giant monsters chasing me now. This is indeed Spooky's House of Jump Scares. Mm, I'm expecting something big! No. You know, I'm just expecting, like, one of those cardboard cutouts to just, like, come alive or something. I found something today to satisfy my unromantic thirst. I woke today with a br from a brief faint and found before me a bottle of red wine. I am not sure what brand or year, for there is no label. All I gather is that it tastes strongly metallic. That's blood! If you don't know, that's blood. I should know, because I'm a vampire. Ah, who am I kidding? I'm a zombie. So. Do I honestly want to be running down this hall? Ma always said, never run with scissors. Mm hmm. Yes, this is quite frightening. Oh. Do I want to go down there? Do I want to see what that is? Morbid curiosity gets the best of me. How are you doing, Mr. Brain? Are you the mastermind from that Fallout 4 DLC? Fallout 3 DLC? Oh my god, Fallout 4, the hype is real. <laughs> I want Fallout 4, but you know you know what I'm talking about. The Brain. I forgot what his name was from uh, Fallout 3's Point Lookout DLC. Nobody probably knows what the hell I'm talking about because I'm a dork. Uh, whatever, I'm getting close to my destination. Can I just sit on here? Can I crouch? No, I can't even sit. Hmm, do I see a face there? See right there's an eye? Yeah, oh, okay, I'll just go. You know, I was trying to admire your painting, Spooky, but, you know, that's too much. Oh, back, back to the lively little, uh, you know, paint, like, okay. Whatever. Whatever floats your boat, I guess. Um, maybe I should go. Locked? 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 Oh, that, I thought that was locked too. I thought that'd be the end of me. Locked! Fuck! Okay, if I was being chased by a monster, I would not have good luck. Oh, God! Um, nice. I don't want to look out there. Can I just sit on you? I don't... Oh! Look at all these YouTubers I don't know. I think I might know that one. Many of them are more popular than me. But I don't care. Oh well, we are at our destination at the elevator. Yes! Elevator! Hang in there! But... I'll hang in there next time I play. I don't think that was wine. I didn't think it was either. Trust me. Alright, let me just descend down once more. Hang in there. Where's the door? Okay. Time to descend deeper in the next episode. So, I will be seeing you in the next... Oh. Yeah, I'll be seeing you in the next episode. Bye-bye.